Hello, Mills here. In the game that's been absorbing my life for a very long time now. In Skyrim. I never thought they would actually let me join the companions. Yeah, me neither. Like they're letting anyone. Well, I just wanted to document a little bit Skior of this game. That I have the strength of Isgrimor, and my brother has his smarts. Yeah, okay. Having lots of fun with this game. Have you been bringing the battle to the Silver Hand, friend? I wish I could be there with another piece of glory. Good work, Shield Sister. Am I looking for work? And there is more work to be done. But I fear that Codlac's gotten wind of our recent. My advice always be honest with the old man, but don't tell him anything he doesn't need to know. So, I am. Let's see. I'm level 55. Uh, wood Elf. I'm uh, 196 hours into this game. Playing obsessively. Smithing at 100%. I think uh, lock picking is up there. Yeah, lock picking is 98. A lot of sneaking. Archery is 100%. Um. Yeah, so I've got a lot of fun stuff here. Um, let's see, I've been using this uh, Magicka Nullifying Inferno Bow. This is my uh, Paralyze uh, Daedric Bow. And that's the pickaxe of Flaming Doom. I used to do a lot of mining. I don't really have to anymore. And then the Soul Bow. Uh, soul bow, which is for uh, collecting soul gems, and that's what that is. But you see, I've got two hundred and eight thousand gold, so I kind of don't need to craft anything or sell anything for sheer money anymore. Um, I've uh, I've got a couple of masks, actually not a whole lot of masks. Um, I've got dragon scale uh, armor. Um, what else can I say? Oh, um, let's see, just general stats here. 94 quests completed, a whole bunch of miscellaneous. Main quests I go very slow on because I end up doing a lot of side things. Um, I finished the Dark Brotherhood, I think I finished the Thieves, and uh, so on and so forth. So I went back to uh, resume the Companion quest which is one of the earliest sets of quests I think that you get to and I kind of I put off turning into a werewolf for a while um where where is this Might guy head down to the metery later I, uh, I avoid up. going to East Mark, no. yeah okay let's see um yeah so I I kind of avoided the um yeah, honey, I avoided I think, the yeah. uh I think it's werewolf just... portion because I just wasn't I don't know it didn't really interest me much Oh, I need to go downstairs, that's what. And uh, so now I'm just kind of filling in the gaps here. And I have no idea what happens next. All right, let's see. Oh, I'm, I see if I get some training. Oh, not from her. Uh, let's see. Once you get up leveling up to the 50s like this, it goes much, much slower uh, in terms of leveling up. Uh, it, it happens a lot more slowly all right um i'm gonna skip some dialogue options too i tend to just read them so uh, i'll probably cut this guy off thank you for coming okay yes youngling have a seat really actually i just recently started sitting while i talk to people I seem much more civilized i hear you've been busy of late y yes your hearts are full of grief and my own weeps at the loss of Skior. But his death was avenged long ago. You have taken more lives than honor. Oh, I'm in trouble. The cycle of retaliation may continue. Okay. In any case, I have it. Have you heard the story of how we came to be werewolves? Uh, have I? I think so. Aye, that sounds like it. 
As in all matters of faith, though, the reality is more complicated than one believer would tell you. So what is the, the truth? The companions are nearly 5,000 years old. One of my predecessors was a good but short-sighted man. Okay. If the companions would hunt in the name of their lord, Hirsin, we would be granted great. They did not believe the change would be permanent. The witches offered, but we had been deceived. Uh, but aren't we the more witches powerful? Didn't lie I usually course. play the nicer route. It's more than our bodies. The disease, you see, affects not just our bodies. Upon death, werewolves are claimed by Hirsin. For his hunting grounds. I already did the here scene thing. This is a paradise. They want nothing more than to chase prey with their men, and that is their choice. But I am still a true Nord, and I wish for some. That's what I've spent my twilight years trying to find out. And now I've found the answer. The witch's magic ensnared us, and only their magic can release us. They won't give it willingly, but we can extract their foul powers by force. I want you to seek them out. Go to their coven in the wilderness. Strike them down as a true warrior of the wild. And bring me their heads, the seat of their abilities. From there, we may begin to undo centuries of impurity. Well, all right then. Heads and witches and okay. Uh, it shall be done. Now move. Talos guide you, lass. All right, so uh, I'm a werewolf now, along with these guys. Uh, this guy wants the uh, the cure, and that's okay with me. I have here in my powers, I have this beast form, which allows me to turn into a wolf. This is my innate ability, command animal, where I can make an animal an ally. I haven't used that at all. This is uh, part of the end of the uh, Thieves Guild thing. Um, I currently have this power where I can absorb 100 points of health. And then uh, Spectral Assassin. I haven't used any of these really. I, I have all of these shouts unlocked. The one I use the most is this one, Aura Whisper, because it allows you to see um, living forms. You can see living people, objects, entities, so that you can sneak around and shoot them, because I favor the bow. And, uh, yeah, I mean, I don't know. I have, I guess I have maximum frost. And uh, the only other thing I have maximum on is uh, unrelenting and whirlwind. I just recently got this one. So I should probably go visit the uh, high Hrothgar again now that I've got that unrelenting force. I assume that gets me through the, uh, through that crazy blizzard that you have to go through. Um, so here in Whiterun, wait, this one. When the Empire surrendered to the old married How do you dominion, manage to hold your ground? Uh, let's see. I spent a lot of time in right run. I was operating out of a couple barrels. This is my first time using fraps with Skyrim, so I don't know if it's stable or not. All right. So I was working out of these two uh, or three barrels over here by the main entrance, and... I mean, literally for. I've been oh. looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. A Not sure who from. He wouldn't say. Just that he was. A Looks like that's it. Got to go. I want that guy's job. All right. So let's see what he. It's usually something. Let's see. Letter from a friend. Yeah, I started demonstrating my shouts in various towns because then you get these handy notes. All right, so uh, mysterious source O power. It's a with you around. Let's go sell some stuff here with Bella Thor. Let me know if you see anything you like. Everything's for sale, my friend. Everything. If I had a sister, I'd sell her in a second. Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. So I tend to uh, use up everybody's money now. I'm at that level where it's uh, nobody has enough money to keep me going. See, look, this one helmet here. That's okay. I'm not complaining. Um, 
Let's see here. Get rid of some of these books. I already do that. Oh yeah, there's a yeah, there's a treasure. Do come back. You know, now that I think about it, there's a treasure that I need to go get. It's um let's see. Oh yeah, look at the map. I've been all over the place. All over the place. Um, but let's see, there was a, oh, I don't even remember what it was called. Um, it's where, it was a mission I just did where I, I went and dealt with the silver hand. Oh, well, no matter. I'll come back to it. All right, so where am I going here? I'm going to, oh, look, the middle of nowhere. So here... There's this, and here there's, oh, the source of power. Uh, so let's see, what's the nearest, uh, let's go here to Knife Point Ridge. Had a companion with me for a while, mostly to act as a pack mule, because I hoard everything. I pick up every little rock. Oh yes, and this is Shadow Mare. Shadow Mirror? Shadow Mirror. I rode him for a little bit and then it got old. Sorry, buddy. Uh, let's see. So. I do a lot of mountain climbing. Ah, uh, leave those guys alone. Don't do a lot of magic. Um. But I might re when I if I replay the game, you know, after the first three hundred hours, <laughs> I might go a Magicka route, Mage. Um, no. Let's see here. Oh, all right, all right. What? Yeah, I'm not collecting as much stuff as I used to. Who are these guys? Friend or foe? I don't know. You there, uh, citizen. This area is off limits. You're interfering with imperial business. Yeah, so you'll have to pay us a fine. Say, a hundred gold. I pay smell a shakedown. Uh, I don't have any gold to spare. Fine. If you can't pay with coin, you'll pay with your life. Now, ain't this a... All right. Well, let's. I don't know. Let's do something here with this guy. Uh, how about um? I actually haven't tried this frost breath. Let's try this out. Oh, I only hit one guy. I'm, you know, I'm I'm kind of weak against mages. I've got this little uh, zoom in matrix time thing, and uh, I end up carrying a whole lot of potions that I don't end up using. So let's use one. Ah! All right. Minor magicka. Oh no. Minor healing. There we go. Got 20 of these. Oh, you know what? Let's just let's upgrade our arrows here may as well. That's paralyzed. Where'd the other guy go? Oh, here he is. No. Yes! Not like this. Yes, like this! Alright. Okay. 
Let's see here. Mostly I just got my arrows back now, but I used to grab every single scrap of loot that I could get my mitts on and then sell it. And that's how you end up with three houses and 200,000 gold. I guess that's part of the way you do that. But uh, no, I mean, you know, you don't have to be a hoarder to enjoy the game. It's just kind of the way I like to play it, so. All right. All right, so we got witchies in here, apparently. Uh, let's uh, let's clear this dungeon out, and I think that'll probably do it for now. All right, so let's see. What else can I tell you? Let's take a look at what we're what we're dealing with. Oh, um, apparel-wise, I've uh, crafted some uh, boots with carrying capacity. More carrying capacity in the gauntlets. Uh, Magicka regen. I do use Magicka for healing and stuff sometimes, so... Uh, payload necklace. Um, I got this on some run somewhere. Got the restoration ring. And I'm currently wearing this mask with even more payload uh, enhancement. Um, and then the wooden mask. Now, at one point, the stuff in my barrels disappeared. Uh, which I it, I was surprised because I'd literally b been playing for over a hundred hours and everything was just fine in there um, But then suddenly the barrels were empty and they were replaced with carrots or something So there was there was some stuff including this mask and this mask is used in a, a Particular area, so I went ahead and uh, used the console command and I gave myself this mask back <laughs> so I gave it back to myself and I don't feel the slightest bit bad about it. I've been carrying this strange amulet around forever and I have no clue what it's for, so there must be some, uh, some mission that uh, I have to get to, so. Um, let's see, what a post scroll, I, I don't use a lot of scrolls. Uh, I can't seem to get the timing right on them. Uh, all these keys, lots of keys. I like having multiples of keys too, that's pretty handy. I don't know what for. And then I have, uh, I do have Azura Star, which is the end of one particular mission. Has a grand soul in it. And uh, let's see, a bunch of commons. Grand, look, I've got 47 grand soul gems just waiting to be filled. You capture soul and then you can enchant weapons with it. Um, yeah, so I, I actually enjoyed crafting. I made a lot of jewelry and things like that with my uh, smithing ability. Uh, and then here, really, there's just nothing that I'm using a, a lot of right now. Uh, here's Illusion. I, I actually did use Clairvoyance a couple of times. Destruction I do use um, from time to time, in particular Flames. But look, that's a novice that's a novice thing. So for a while, I didn't even have the uh, Magicka to use this kind of stuff. I do use Restoration a lot. Um, I don't really use the ward, I, but I use uh, fast healing and uh, healing hands to uh, help my companion sometimes. And then shouts we already kind of looked at. Um, yeah, some of these I haven't really used much. Um, and then powers and then active effects. I've got some recover health and yeah, that kind of thing. So. Uh, let's see, what else is there? Oh, well, just, um, the one thing that I'm currently looking forward to, given that I like to craft and, uh, and, uh, enchant things, is to get to this, no, uh, oh, no, wait, I'm sorry, it's an enchantment thing. Here we go. I think once I level up, I'm gonna do this one two enchantments on the same item. I've wanted to do that since the beginning of the game. Oh wait, look, I already have a perk. All right, I'll, I'll do it now. Yeah, I let the perks build up sometimes. So level three enchantment. And so now, yeah, I can enchant things uh, twice. So I'll probably uh, make a couple Daedric bows and enchant them doubly with something. So, all right, in the meantime, let's, uh, let's go back in here and let's take care of this uh, 
Let's take care of this cave. Wait, where are the glass arrows? Don't I have glass arrows here? No? What happened to the glass arrows? Oh. Got removed from my favorites list for some reason. Alright, uh, quick save. I do use quick save a lot. Because I'm really not interested in repeating stuff all the time. Oh, I had the wrong thing set. I thought it was Aura Whisper. Let's try that. Let's set that up again. Alright. So. There's a Hag Raven over there. Ooh, chest. Yeah, I'm, I was always a fairly good lock picker. And, um... Yeah, that hasn't really been a problem, picking locks. Uh, Fallout certainly trained me to do that. Really enjoyed Fallout, the Fallout games. Okay, so let's uh, let's do some sneak attacks on these uh, on these folks here. Oh, that's oh that's somebody I need to get their head or whatever. All righty then. So I'm sneaking. You see that little reticle in the middle? It looks like an eyeball. If you make noise, they start looking for you. Oh, there's a big old spider. Actually, uh, since I have so many soul gems around, I'll bust out the soul bow. May as well uh, capture this guy. Groovy. Uh, they just recently, in a in the recent patch, they added that kill cam, which is pretty neat. I'm enjoying that. Um, all right. Oh dear, look at that. That's scary. All right, we'll take that. We'll take this stuff. Um, oh, lots of ingredients. I've divined the use for lots and lots and lots of ingredients. Just sometimes when I'm watching TV, I just do combinations of ingredients and I've managed to unlock a fair amount of them. So, um, and, but yeah, I end up carrying just vast amounts of potions and I don't even know what to do with it all. Oops. Uh, where was that spider? Oh, he was up here. Yeah, I don't collect frostbite venom anymore. It doesn't really do much, but I want my arrows back. Why do I want my arrows back? I don't know. Look, I've got 237 glass, 851 ebony, and then, of course, this is the one that I'm trying to collect now, these uh, Daedric arrows, because they're tough. Um, let's see. Frame rate, uh, for me, is a little a little bit sketchy running fraps, so I'm, it's a little bit more sort of jerky. Oh, I got poisoned. It's a poison effect there. But um, my wood elf race is resistant to poison and disease just naturally. So I think that's helped me. Um, let's see. Where am I going? I do try to sweep. How many of these witches are there? I guess four more. I do like to sweep entire dungeons. You know, I, I, I leave no, no stone unturned. Uh, I don't know if I need black soul gems for these. For this lot. Ow! Oh, all right. Because I don't think I have any empty black soul gems. You need black soul gems to capture the souls of uh, people. Yeah, I may as well get all the heads. Why not? 
Uh, let's see. Troll fat. This is an enchanter, an arcane enchanter. Ooh, wait, wait a minute. Maybe I can enchant something. Now that I have the double ability. Yeah. I have, I've unlocked all these enchantments. You unlock encha uh, enchantments by disenchanting, destroying uh, something that has an enchantment on it. So let's see, what can we... Um... Oh no, wait a minute. How come it's not listed here? Choose a... How do I... Oh, you know, I maybe I have to do it all at one go. All right, so I can't add an enchantment to something that already has one, so... That explains that. Read all the books. Well, not all the books. Just read the books that that have a value of like 50 gold or more because they've got boosts to your abilities. Check barrels for ingredients. That kind of thing. Uh, again, I'm uh, I'm sparing you a whole lot of uh, hoarding that I was doing because uh, yeah, no one wants to watch that. But uh, I'm really enjoying this game. I really enjoyed Fallout 3, Fallout New Vegas. I, tr I played uh, some of Oblivion. Uh, it was on sale uh, on Steam. You know, like really cheap. Bless Steam for its marvelous sales. And, uh, and, and I didn't quite get into it. I mean, I could tell there was something there. It was really I was playing it in order to scratch that Fallout itch. Um, I might actually go back and play it after this because I am enjoying the setting a little bit. A little bit uh, of the story, if you will. It's pretty deep. Um, it's it's good. It's you, you can see a lot of care went into it, but I'm not real heavily invested in the particulars. Um, yeah. Us? Yeah. All right. Yeah, I think this 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 one's pretty much done here. I think. Grab all that, and well, I, I, you know, I haven't seen a lot of summoned Daedra, actually. Maybe I'm just not playing it right. Uh, let's see here. All right, so let's just go get this last head here. How many heads are there? Two, two, oh, two more heads. The dragons are pretty awesome. Very well done. Where am I going? It, it, they crop up a lot sometimes and, and I'm not in the mood to deal with them at that moment. Um, and I have, uh, I have 25 souls collected so I have a lot of unlocking I can do I just have to find the things maybe maybe that's what I'll do next is I'll find the source of power in blah 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 whatever that was because that'll probably have a shout at the end of it uh, this probably won't hit her oh it will okay 2x damage because I'm sneaking ah Hello? Zap. Alrighty then. I don't hear any spiders. What's in here? Where'd you go? Oh, there's a spider right there. Look at you, little sneaky McSneakerton. Stealth spider, ninja spider. Uh, that, 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 that. Sure, why not? I'm not sure, I haven't been keeping up on my, uh... oh, I guess I didn't know invisibility. Uh, you click on the book and you read it and then you learn that particular spell. All right. Whenever there's pools of water, 
take a look. There might be some uh, caves or chests or hidden things. All right, shrooms. One last chamber. We go out here and uh, here, yeah, here and bare left. I've held off on choosing sides in the Civil War in the story because I don't want to limit access. I like to roam everywhere. Bear right. Um, so I'm putting that off for as long as I can. Let's see, let's do the uh, Inferno bow here for a little bit. Now my sneaking ability is pretty high because I do this a lot. I crouch and do uh, do my uh, sniping from far away. Oh. Owie. Anybody else in here? Any more sneaky spiders? Who's this? Oh, that's the headless uh, hag raven. The witch. Anything down here? No. All right, get me out of here. Um. No chest or anything in here? I guess not. Up there, maybe? No. All right, I think this place is, uh, this house is clean. Let's, uh, go here. Okay. I enjoyed the Dark Brotherhood, uh, missions. I think I enjoyed them better than the Thieves Guild missions. Uh, I, I like the Daedric ones. I've solved. A, I've solved. I've finished a, a few of those. Uh, what am I doing next? I'm going to be going back to what you call it. Okay. But um, what was the? Uh, ah, yes. Find the source of power in what you call it. Oh, uh, Bard's College. Uh, it's definitely worth your while to talk to those guys at the Bard's College because when you complete missions for them, they upgrade lots of skills. Like at one go, they'll upgrade like five skills or something. I did not realize that until hours into the game. Uh, Alright, so let's see where this source of power is. Oh, it's out here in the middle of nowhere. I haven't been there. Uh, yeah, let's go to this uh, orc hovel over here. Alrighty. Uh, to the right. Eh, let's try going this way. You know what? I'll probably uh, I'll probably cut this out because you don't want to see me mountain climbing. Sometimes this works. Sometimes it doesn't. In this case, it doesn't. Let's see. It's hard to tell. Look at the topography here. Yeah, I guess if I go this way and bear to the right, eventually I'll get there. Some bear. I hear a bear. Grizzly! Zap! Oh dear, okay. Now see, if I wanted to be a nice guy, I could have used my little command animal power, but I don't really need him to do anything for me, so. Uh, that's a, I think that's a dwarven dwarf place. Or no, that's, uh, okay, Reach Wind. The dwarf uh, facilities have these mechanical, sort of robotic, yikes, robotic uh, contraptions. The dwarves themselves are 
longs extinct. And uh, so that can be entertaining as well. Um, no, this, this terrain is not going to be very helpful. Hey, leave that goat alone. Pick on someone your own size. All right, so you know what? Let's do uh, let's do something other than the bow here. We'll dual wield some flames. Come here. Where'd you go? Anybody else? I definitely play in first person, not in third. And, uh, yeah, my, uh, yeah, my, my magic is not great. Wait, what am I trying to do? Here we go. See, it's, it's 260. Yeah, clearly I have other priorities when it comes to, when it comes to weapons and whatnot. Quick save, and where are we? Not much closer. I hope this works. Probably along this river here. I really like the music. I like the weather effects that come in from time to time. They're very cool. Yeah, this looks like a way in. Yeah, maybe. Some really, really beautiful vistas. The uh, the dungeon design is is terrific. Um, you know they they repeat a lot of elements but but they they're really creative about arranging them so it doesn't really feel very repetitious you know af after 200 hours oh dragon it's kind of far away though what is over there all right well there's a dragon on the other side of that uh ridge there that's the red dot up in the compass. I don't know. He's a little far. I don't think we're going to get to uh, deal with him. So that's all right. Oh, he's on the move. He's a little far away, though. Don't be mad. Maybe I can get up there. Uh-oh. Who's this? Oh. Someone behind me. Oh, I hate that frost thing. Oh. It just slows me down. All right. Uh, why don't we do something like, uh, I don't know. Leave me alone. Oh, look at that. Oh, look. And then a dragon all of a sudden. Where did I last save? Oh, I hate to think. Oh, all right. That frost thing drives me nuts. It's t you take all kinds of damage and it slows you down. All right, let me get back to where I was.
Hey, did you like how I completely glossed over the fact that I was killed by two Forsworn, which is kind of sad? <laughs> the Forsworn, they're not very tough. But that didn't stop them from trouncing me. Oh, I'm detected, am I? Yeah. All right, let's upgrade our arrows. And let's put some let's put some stamina poison on this one. If I have any poison of uh, Do I even have any? I don't think I have any. Well, let's do some poison damage. Oofa. And you need to stop. Oh, I refuse to die by this thing yet again. Extreme healing. And what I saw some magicka poison in here somewhere. Deadly magicka poison. All right, now I just need to hit her. Thwap! Take that! Oh, there's a dragon behind me. All right. Ah! Okay. First things first. Quick save. All right, dragon. Let's do this. Come down here. Oh, he's still playing hard to get. All right, well, let's see. Where am I? Bear to the right. Maybe uh maybe I'm headed to his little his little lair anyway. First, I must know what's in this sack. Five carrots. Awesome. Get my arrows back, if I can. Oh, powdered mammoth tusk. I haven't done much with that. Nope. I pretty much don't pick up anything that doesn't have a value of more than 200 now. It's taking me downhill now. Yes, indeed, the dragon animations were excellent in this game. There, there's some glitches sometimes where they, you know, where they end up in strange positions. Oh, like catching butterflies. Where's the butterfly? Got him. All right. Um, oh, there's another butterfly. Come here, butterfly. Okay. Yes, I run around like an idiot catching butterflies. All right. There's something up ahead. There's a source of power. Where's the dragon? Boy, he's all over the place, that guy. Where's he going? Look at him. The draw distance in this game is wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Yep, I can't recommend this game highly enough. Uh, all right. Valthum. Oh, looks like I'm going to have to go inside to deal with this one. All right. Well, you see how I just sort of wander from one place to another. Friend or foe, identify yourself. I think he's a bad guy. 
Oh, wait, no, he's not. Hey! Leave, stranger. Evil stirs in this place. I fear for the security of the very land if it should break free. What we evil do you mean? At the tomb of Hednorak, who has been dead for many generations. I fear, however, that his return may be at hand. All right, I'll truncate a little bit here. Must be a way to stop this. I have been holding him here. By now, I'm I can fading. barely contain his power, much less defeat him if he awakens. But with the help of a living champion, I may be able to succeed. You would do this? Three vessels in the tomb below hold the power to vanquish at Norak. Before anything else, we need those. Bring I guess you're me, coming with me. But be careful, mortal. Oh. They are guarded by Hathnorak's minions. They will stop at nothing to see their master return. Rounding up chunks of things is my middle name. Bob rounding up chunks of things mills. Ooh, I can sit on the skeleton. Oh, hey, this seat's taken. All right. All right. So let's, uh, let's deal with this, shall we? You scary dungeon music. Let's see, do I have my, uh, yeah, my Aura Whisper locked and loaded? Yeah, boy, leveling up goes a lot slower when you get up to this, this level. I, I'm been just shy of 55 for a really long time now. Uh, all right, let's see. See, with the Aura Whisper... Yes. Yeah. I expected I would see someone in this sarcophagus here, but I guess that's not the case. A bunch of guys in the distance there. Couple of guys down there. I always, always, always collect every little bit of gold that I find. Every little bit of it. Uh, you know what? I need to check the charge on my weapons here. Let's see. That one's okay. See this bar right here? tells you how much of a of a charge it has if you will oh freeze is completely tapped out so I'm going to pick a soul gem Let's see if I have any lesser ones down here a petty and a lesser and another lesser and then I'll jump up here to a common so I use the smaller ones first because the larger ones are worth more um, in order uh, to enchant uh, weapons and whatnot. Oh, that's a button. That's a trigger. There's some nastiness that happens if I step on that and I'm not sure if I can get around it. Maybe I can, let's see. Nope. Oh, we got that guy though. <laughs> All right, good on you. Oh, uh, if you have your, uh, your bow drawn and you press uh, R, the same one you use for sheathing your weapon, it will relax it without losing the arrow. I didn't learn that until about 170 hours into the game. How lame is that? Oh, the other thing I didn't know also is that when there's a, 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 a cable across the floor, like a trap, uh, you can use the arrow to set it off as well. Didn't know that either. Also didn't know until the longest time that oh, there are some uh, canisters of... Uh, like lights, like a flame that are hanging from the ceiling that you can shoot down and then it will light the oil that's on the ground on fire. So, you know, you just never really know what you're going to find. You hear that guy? I do. 
Oh, there he is. Zap. Okay, that kill cam wasn't very good. Uh, let's see here. Urns always have gold in them. Well, if they have anything in them, they have gold in them. Um... You know, apparently there's a way to use uh, paper and charcoal and, and something like that to make your own scrolls, but I, I have no idea how to do that. I have this, uh, I have this forge, where is it? Yeah, this uh, Atronach forge recipe to make a storm Atronach. But I don't know how to do this. I don't know how to make this, so I guess... It's not a high priority for me because I'm I'm not really big on scrolls actually, uh, and so I don't know maybe maybe I'll never know. Uh, wait, what was over here? The secret door. This is going to be locked. It's not locked. It's barred from the other side. You know the dungeon design is really good. Um, I'm used to it now, of course, 200 hours into it, but. They, they plunge you all the way back and then they bring you around and they give you an exit so that you can get out more easily. Very well done. Um, it's a, and very much appreciated. So you don't have to retrace your steps too much. Oh, who's that? That can't be good. Oh, let me quick save. It's a little floaty guy. Oh, he doesn't show up on uh, on my radar here. But there's this guy sitting in a chair, minding his own business, thinking deep thoughts, like about how I just killed him. Woke up his buddy. Oh, this is a, uh, what do they call him? Uh, Death Lord. Oh, he's mad. He's angry. He's going to shout at me, too. Nope. Hey, level up? No, no level up. Oh, there we go. Okay. Cool. Uh, let's see. Where are we? These are the stairs here, right? Where'd you go? Okay. More gold. A ring. No, I've, I've, I've uh, crafted a whole lot of jewelry, too. for Mostly for money. Lots and lots of jewelry. Uh, do I need to jump over here for something? Sometimes when they give you a ledge, it's there's a reason for it. And sometimes it's just cosmetic. Okay. Let's jump down here. Beware of this in case it opens. Is that the way I'm going to have to go? It might be. Let's see here. Uh, first, let's go... Yeah, I think I'm going to have to go down there. I hear breathing. Come on. Nope, orcish stuff. It's not high enough. Really not interested. Um, let's see, how am I gonna get up there? There must be some other way. Oh yeah, see these pots right here. You shoot these pots down and they'll crash down and drop their contents. The skeever. Here, let's do that. Let's shoot this pot down right here. Can I just shoot the pot itself? Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I don't actually do that often. Oh, there's another switch right there. Another scary switch. Oh, you. It's a dragon priest. 
are you just leaving me further down? Is that what it is? Yeah. Okay. He's not ready to be engaged with yet. Skeevers are like big rats. Oh, there's a lab in there. Oh, there's a guy behind that wall there. A death lord. He will shout at me in a second here. Or try to. Voss. Oh, he's mad. Look at him. Calm down. Now, the enemies are good. I'm kind of making light of it, but they're, you know... Especially in lower levels, they're they're really engaging and fun to to deal with. So I'm I am making opaque vessel. Oh, oh, yeah, right. that's what I'm here for. Okay, yeah, I forgot. I forgot I was here for those. Uh, but anyway, no, the 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 the, the uh, a ring. I saw a ring. Ruby, silver ruby ring. Yeah, the bad guys are really good in this. Uh, I've been very pleased. Um, really good at scaling up the difficulty, making it not impossible, but still difficult. Um, yeah, I definitely uh, definitely like that. That's definitely a uh, Bethesda touch. Just checking the map. I make liberal use of the map. Okay. You. <laughs> they hear the noise behind them and then they turn around. Now in that case I just missed him so I'm covering up my mistake by saying oh yeah I meant to do that. He's going to shoot ice bolts at me. Oofa. Here, let's capture his uh, his soul here with the soul bow. I don't know what I'll use it for, but may as well. Who else wants some? Tell your friends. This guy. Oh, I'm not really good at leading him, I guess, with this thing. the death lord oh he was leading me with that shout hold on two can play this shouting game <laughs> what do you think of that big mouth try it again try it again one more time. Negative. All right. Uh, let's see here. Let's grab things. Uh, let me put the shot back to Aura before I forget. I always forget and then I'm shouting when I don't mean to and that's so embarrassing it's so awkward I'm like oh I'm sorry I I misspoke didn't mean to shout uh, is there a door back here I'm gonna unlock this door here there we go 
No. Okay. Garlic. Uh, chest. A book. Nope. See the cheap books there. Uh, you know, I, I was looking at them, but then I got a clue finally and realized that the books that are worth picking up and reading, I mean, aside from their delectable contents, see a book has pages of stuff in it. And I'm actually really not that into it. Again, I, I appreciate it, and it definitely adds uh, flavor and atmosphere. But I, I don't sit there and read them, I'm afraid. I really don't. Um, a flute. And, uh, yeah, these books are not particularly interesting. All right. So back to the business at hand. Let's see, way down, I think, right over here. Um, all right, so straight and then to the left. Oh, these are coffins, aren't they? Yeah. Skeletons. Anything in these coffins here? No. There doesn't seem to be much in coffins, actually. All right. On to the next empty vessel. Gotta flip a switch. Yeah, I got a lot of jewelry here now. Rings and and then I've got a lot of gems. There's a ruby. I got five witch heads. I can decorate my houses with. Uh, let's see. Oh, okay. Flip the switch. Little pig. Little pig. Let me in. Oh, I have to go through a door first. Okay. Where is it? Oh, this is that room. Yep, this is the room I was looking at through there. Embalming tool. Glass gauntlet of extreme lock picking. All right. And then uh, for a while I was uh, nurturing the two-handed weapon skills. Because I, I, I never really tried that sort of thing before, and it w I was having fun. I was liking the two-handed weapon, but then in the end, I just I just like sniping, so uh, I just stuck with uh, I just stuck with the bows. Oh, so just in case I don't come upon another one, here's the uh, alchemy lab. This is where you can take the, all the ingredients, all the things that you've been collecting and hauling around, and you kind of mix them into combinations. You see, I've unlocked a lot of formulas already things that you can make with it so um, so for example if I wanted to restore health I got these ingredients to choose from and uh, as long as they have restore health I guess in their active abilities they can be combined in order to make potions so blister wart and a butterfly wing and this is a potion to restore health and because of the skill that I have at the moment that determines how many points of health you get but you can also add a third ingredient, uh, and you can tr do this sort of by trial and error, and if you add a third ingredient, you can sometimes add an additional effect. So let's take a look at some of these ingredients, like hawk feathers. Okay, that didn't add anything. Let's just click until we find something. Okay, this one, canis root, it actually changes it and becomes poison. Uh, so let's stick with the restore health component, though. There's poison again, more poison. 
you know, don't really... Uh, seems to want to make poison. Okay, so, yeah, so see, this allows you to restore 42 points of health, but then you also haggle for better prices for 30 seconds. So, you you know, there's some weird combinations there. Let's just, uh... Maybe I can damage something. Damage health. 13 points of poison damage. Sure! That's actually not a lot of damage, but... Um, I was fortifying marksman, but I kind of don't need it anymore. I like paralysis, but not in poison. I like paralysis. Uh, enchantment is uh, one of my favorite enchantments. Anyway, okay, that's enough of uh, alchemy. So, just wanted to show what that screen looked like. Uh, I haven't saved in a while. Let's do that. My arrow. Okay. So let's see, where was I? You empty? Yes. So I need to go... What is this? The... Uh, okay, that's the exit. Do I... I need to go back to the catacombs also? Have I been in the catacombs? I don't remember if I have. That looks like a door. It's not though, okay. Wait. Yeah, over here to the left, okay. By the way, I know that I have not allocated my level up points yet. Not really in a super hurry to do that. At this point. Yes. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Ah! Where'd you come from? You know, that's not the first time that a giant spider has startled me from dropping down from above. <laughs> it's kind of scary, huh? <laughs> Good times. Yes. Yeah. All right, that's what was waiting in the wings. Yeah. Yeah, you gotta gotta keep an eye on everything, all around you at all times. Oh, sorry, guy. Let's see here. There's been more than one uh, chest hidden behind webs like this, so it's always good to take a look. Okay. Back to the matter at hand. Is there any other access? No. Aw, oh, you're pulling my chain. All right, now I've gotten used to the fact that when they're skeletons that look like this, they're not gonna do anything. But when they look like this, they're gonna come to life. So I preemptively deal with them. Is that cheating? Maybe, maybe not. There's another uh, floor switch.
They've always got some goodies on them. Don't discount the Draugr because of their weird name. Who's next? Oh, uh, there's a guy right there. Orcish boots. I don't need to carry orcish boots. There we go. Yeah, see, I got a lot of carry weight left. All right, let's level up. Let's do this thing here. Uh, stamina, health, magic. Uh, I don't even know anymore. Let's go health. I'll save that perk for later. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Save. All right, let's wrap this. Uh, let's wrap this crawl up, shall we? Take care of this guy. Oops. You know what? Let's bust out a shout. Uh, what should we do? Let's just do something different. Uh, fire, f frost. Uh, disarm that's not powerful enough to disarm him. I already tried that. Ice form or blizzard? Well, I don't remember. Let's try blizzard. Well, that didn't do much. I guess he's taking some damage, though. Maybe it slows him down a little. Don't do it. Nope. Don't do it. Shut your mouth. Okay. Yeah, you know, the shouts, I don't know. They're a little hit or miss. I like, I like getting them and everything, but... I don't know, there's only a couple that I really come back to again and again. Maybe I just need to unlock unlock more of them to the third level. Or get or rather, you know, get the third word, I should say. Oh hi. Yikes! Oof. Uh. Yeah, okay. What am I using? Glass arrows? No, I'm using ebony. Stop it! Leave me alone. Let's uh, let's set him on fire. Okay. Oh, ebony sword. Sure, why not? You like that technique of mine of backing up and backing up and backing up like a big chicken? All right, where are we going? If I go this way. Leads to the same place, yes. Ah! Did I set that off? How did I set that off? Nope, it's just an obstacle course. Am I doing that? I can't tell if I'm doing that. I'm not. What's on the other side? Well, you know what? I have this shout, right? I could do this. I could do this uh, whirlwind sprint. Ooh. Why not? Let's do that. Yes. That was fast. I guess I won't look through that little window. Wait, who sees me? Hey, how come the fire doesn't turn on on him? 
That's no fair. Oh, you're stuck. Talk about no fair. What? What? Stabby, stabby. Oh, those are soul gems doing that. Okay. Um, let's just carry on. Let's just keep on keeping on. Uh, let me get my Aura Whisper back, though. Aura Whisper, shh. The thing about the Aura Whisper is it's, a, it's a quiet shout. It is sotto voce, as they say. Yeah, that's a fancy word. Or words, as the case may be. These little 5 gold, 2 gold, 10 gold, they add up after a while. They really do. Not to mention the jewelry and stuff. Okay. There's all kinds of badness back here. Oh, there's two overlords. That one walks funny. Ha! That one, <laughs> that one went looking for the source of the sound. All right, I'm gonna need some help dealing with two of them. Ufa. Yikes. Hold on. Let's see what I can do with an ebony sword. I'm I'm not very good at single-handed stuff. Um oh, but the other thing I can do is do some destruction with the other hand, right? Flames. What does that do for you? Anything? There we go. Yeah, my one-handed has almost no experience. Uh, or rather, what's the word I'm looking for? Intensity, ability, leveling. One way to increase your armor is to get hit a lot. <laughs> and he hit the floor switch. And we're having barbecue. Okay. See that switch there makes that wall of spikes move. Okay. That's enough uh, one-handed stuff. I'm really not built for that. Where was the other guy? It's back here. Another ebony sword. Oh, I can dual wield. Let's see here. Where's the... Haven't done that before. Yeah, yeah, Ooh, ha, yeah. Whoa, whoa, he, he, whoa, whoa. All right, I'll carry this around for a little bit. Let's see what happens. Well, that's exciting. That's up close and personal. Here's another one right here. Oh, wacky kill cam finishing move. Okay, that's enough of that. Let's go back to what we know and love. Meanwhile, I'm still in the right place, right? Okay.
I don't think that's going to fit through there. Oh, maybe it is. Maybe through there? Yep. And... <laughs> I do like that cam. The camera. As usual, these places are humongous. Show yourself. Oh, another death lord. <laughs> I do enjoy that one. Okay. Glass arrows all around. Let's see, where are we? Check this guy. He's positively sizzling with energy. Uh, let's see. I guess... Yep, I guess I need to go down here anyway. One of these is going to open up. I just know it. I guess not. This guy. What's he waiting for? Wakey, wakey. Eggs and bakey. Oh. <laughs> that was odd. All right. Do a little quick save here. Surely the end is in sight. Oh, this looks like a serious door here. Got some serious spiders. Oh, big Bertha. Oh, maybe not so big. Oh, yes. Uh, that's a claw that goes into that key over there, but I recognize these little jets. Those are either going to be flames or probably poison arrows, so we got to grab this thing and then back up immediately. Fire. Fire! 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 Is that just gonna stay on? Oh, alright. Okay, there we go. Thank you! Okay, so now we need to turn these little rings in a pattern, and I think there's different... it, it appears on different things uh, uh, in different areas. Uh, but Sometimes it's right there, right on the bottom of the whatchamacallit. So we got, what, a dragon, the birdie, and the wolf. So, dragon. The birdie. And the wolfie. Okie dokie.
Let's upgrade here to... Oh, I hear... I hear chanting. That means I'm going to learn a word here in a second. Yikes! Holy mackerel, look at all of them! Uh oh, this this could be a little difficult. Um, let's try something. Let's go. Let's do. How about this? Conjure something up. Yeah. Oh, I'm I'm on fire too. That's no good. Uh. Maybe I should try a scroll. Firestorm. <laughs> oh no. Uh healing. Uh, let's do another scroll. Reanimate a weak body. Blizzard? Sure. Yikes! Why am I doing one-handed? I'm no good at, at one-handed stuff. What? What's my shout? <sighs> Alright. Let's, uh... Let's be serious here. Sure, why not? And he's paralyzed. Okay. That was entirely too much work. And what turns the fire on, anyway? Okay, let's save. I don't want to have to do that again. That's excellent, because that's my favorite shout. So you see, I can unlock Hunt, and uh, it lasts longer. So let's do that. I've got 25 Dragon Souls, so why wouldn't I? All right, now my Aura Whisper is supercharged. That's cool, I'm very pleased. And there's a Flawless Diamond in here. Very nice. And, uh... Staff of Fireballs. Those things are dangerous. I... 
Yeah, those things are dangerous. Okay, um... I still have one more of these things to get, don't I? I assume I'm going in the right direction because, again, superior dungeon design from the Bethesda folks. So, um, just a quick uh, mention that uh, I'm still planning on playing uh, Minecraft for what it's worth. I just got distracted by work and by this. Um, but I plan on working on the Black Desert and stuff like that. Still still having fun with that. Plan on returning to it. Actually, that's one of the neat things about the game is that you, it has some real legs about it. But um, right now, this is just too much fun. Where's the... Where's the last... Do I have them all? I don't have them all, do I? Oh, I don't have it highlighted. No wonder. Where's the last one? What? I have to go way back there? Alright, let me scurry on over there and I'll be right back. Oh, but wait, what? Here, let's see what's down here. Spider. Yeah, I forgot about this little pit down here. Oh, there's all kinds of little creepy crawlies. Egg sacks. Here, let's try, uh... Oh! You! Hey, where are you going? What? Come back here. Chicken? He just ran away. down here. No sense sneaking. Hello? <laughs> I feel bad. He, uh, Cellar key. What, uh... Was there some door back here? Ah. Wooden plate? No, what kind of plate was that? Oh, well, I don't care. That's fine. What cellar? Was there a cellar down here? Huh. All right. I don't know. All right, let me get back to the uh, catacomb door. Okay, so here we are, back at the right door. Oh, I guess I just, I just flat out missed the vessel. So I don't think I need to kill anything anymore. I think everything's done. How did I miss it? So 
Straight, right, left. Straight. Right. Left. Oh, yeah, this is the room with the crazy uh, soul gems. Okay. It's shooting fire. Nobody in here? Okay. Just a little parting gift. <laughs> okay, now I'm just wasting arrows. Okay, um, exit. Nearest. Straight, right, left, left. Straight, right, left, left. Try not to step on the traps. How embarrassing. Gotta get back to Mr. Ghost. Give him the vessels. And hopefully there won't be some crazy twist where suddenly he turns on me and says, Mwaha, you did my bidding and now I will be your undoing. Yeah, you like that copy? That ad copy there? Not ad copy, that, uh... Wait, what's this? Oh, the ritual. We're gonna do some sort of ritual. Uh, yeah, so that's, uh... That's some sample dialogue there of how that works. Uh, sure. Haha, -ha, you have fallen into my trap. You know, I sound like I'm making fun, but really, I'm really enjoy. I really like the game. I'm just sort of babbling at this point, so... This is why I'm not going to do a full let's play of this game because it just really I, I would drive me crazy listening to myself. I like single player games. I mean, I like multiplayer ones too, but this is obviously a single player game and it's very absorbing and uh, I like it that way. I wish I knew where I was going. How do I get up there? Oh. This is kind of roundabout. Well, you know what? If I had if I had gotten the uh, if I had gotten the vial, the vessel in the first place, I probably wouldn't have to retrace all my steps like this. So it's completely my fault. No one to blame but myself. All right, so we're gonna do some yikes. We're gonna do some ritual, and then all will be made clear. Um, yeah. Sure seems like I'm taking the long way back, doesn't it? Okay, here we are, back here. Yeah, this is where it originally brought me, uh, but I had to go back for the... Yikes! I had to go back for the... The vessel. Alright. Here you go, Captain. Always save before something crazy happens. You found the vessels. I was worried that I had sent you to your death. In life, Hevnorak drained his own blood from his body. His goal was to transfer his power back into himself. The vessels contain that very blood. Empty them, and you remove any chance he has of regaining his former powers. More uh, dangerous this seems dangerous. Than you know. Left alone, however. He will awaken when he has grown too powerful to be stopped. 
This is the only way to be sure. Very well. Let's do Empty this. The vessels into the sconce near the throne. Then sit in the throne. When you have done so, I will unbind Hevnorak. He will awaken in a weakened state. But the Lich is still to be reckoned with. Be ready. Oh, I'm so ready. Um, so let's see. What should I have in my bag of tricks? Let's nullify some magicka. Let's, uh, I don't know. What am I wearing? Wearing anything good? Regeneration. Uh, what's my other helmet? Oh, no, I, you know what? I sold my other helmet. I'll put this on. Oh, carrying too much. See, that's the trap you get with the uh, payload stuff. Um, let's make sure that everything's charged. Or charged enough. We'll go with the uh, Daedric arrows. Try to cut down on how long this takes. Um, yeah, sure. Another quick save. All right. Let's pour in the blood. Yeah. Ooh, and then I sit down, and then we get ready to parte. I can't believe I just said that. We get ready to parte. Ah! You! You do not frighten me, scary dude. Ah! Hey, you know what? I think I have a resist shock thing. Let's see. Don't I have that? I never use this stuff. Here we go. Resist shock. That's good. Um, why don't we also do something else? Regeneration. And let's do another poison. Lotus extract. So be it. So mote it be. Did I hit him? I did. Wow, he is powerful. This is going to be time consuming. Yikes. All right. Let's do some damage health, some extreme healing. What are you shooting at? How come the ghost dude isn't helping me out? Oops. Shall I shout at him? Oh, that hardly does anything. When you're a dragon priest. Where are you? Oh wait, are these glass arrows? Oh. Come on. Why? I thought I chose... Oh, I ran out of Daedric arrows, that's why. It equips, I guess it equips your weakest arrows, which is kind of weird, but all right. Show yourself. Oh yeah, this is gonna take some work.
Let's, uh, let's conjure some things. Reanimate. I don't think there's anything around to reanimate. Flaming familiar. Okay. I don't think I've ever conjured a flaming familiar. And then how about... I like these guys too. And uh, let's go back to... This. Oh, that didn't take long. What? Did you turn on me? He turned on me. It's not very nice. One right after another. Keep my distance, too. This is the only reason I need to add stamina. So I can do this little zoom in doodad. Oh, wait. Let's change to the uh, soul bow. We're gonna put the finishing touches on this guy. This is it. There we go. Quick save. Oh. Look at all these arrows. What a hack. Although I guess he's like some kind of spirit so it passes through him. I don't know. I'm not going to complain. Wait, before I talk to this guy, let me go get my... Let me get what's coming to me. Because he's got a mask on. Sprayed on the ground. It creates a wall of lightning that does 50... Well, okay, that's pretty cool. Immune to disease and poison. Uh, poison. Oh, well, that's not great. Uh, yeah. But at least my mask collection is growing. Thank you, hero. Now I may finally rest. Take of Norak's iron mask. It may be of use to you. Uh, okay, I think I cut him off. Well, alrighty then. There's a couple of uh, dungeons there taken care of. We'll just uh, scurry back out here and see if that dragon is still around. Actually, I don't care so much about the dragon. It's just now I have another mask. I can go over here to this place. A dragon might show up here. That has happened before. But in here, there's a very special room over here. That makes use of the wooden mask that I'm carrying around. See this dilapidated, trashed room? Well, we just put on our wooden mask. And now we are back in time. Spooky. And then on this altar here, 
We've got a place to put masks. Now, I'm going to keep the mask that I'm wearing, but uh, Horga Horgas, where is he? Here we go. Hevnorak. I think we can put his mask on there. And uh, I believe once I have all the masks, I get a special super duper mask it's right here in the middle. And that'll be exciting. So, all right. Well, I think uh, this is a good place to wrap up. If you made it this far, thanks for watching. It's a really fun game. I just really wanted to capture kind of some of the fun that I was having. And uh, I, I really don't expect to do another one unless there's, I don't know. No, I, I probably won't. But um, likely some more Minecraft down the road. And uh, I don't know, maybe I'll do this if I'm playing a game and I go along a fair bit and I enjoy it and I want to sort of capture what it feels like and that way I can remember what it was like back then but meanwhile I've got a whole lot more playing to do um, yeah I have, let's see there's only only one bunny slaughtered so you see I have a lot a long way to go um, but yeah great game Skyrim and um, hey thanks for watching Thank you.